The head of one of the province's top post-secondary schools is under fire tonight over some questionable spending. Red River College President Stephanie Forsyth used her expense account to pay for such things as golf shoes and car washes, according to documents uncovered by the Canadian Taxpayers Federation. Global's Dan Grummet has more. In just over two years, Red River College President Stephanie Forsyth has racked up more than $78,000 in expenses. But some of those purchases may not have been business related. Acting on a tip, the Canadian Taxpayers Federation used the Freedom of Information Act to obtain Forsyth's expense claims. Someone from the inside of Red River College was upset about some of the president's expenses. Uh, we can't blame him. Among them, Forsyth's vehicle insurance and license, $1,749. A winter tire package for a BMW, $1,482. Hundreds in extra vehicle and tire maintenance, a $100 duffel bag, and $205 for golf shoes. We're also aware of a lot of trips back to British Columbia, which is where she came from. We attempted to contact Forsyth, but we're told she's in Ottawa on business. We then requested a telephone interview with her, and we're told no, she's too busy with meetings. The college instead released a statement from its Board of Governors. It's addressed to the Taxpayers Federation and reads, The Board of Governors takes very seriously its responsibility for fiscal prudence and will consider the items you've pointed out to provide reassurance that these expenses are indeed appropriate for reimbursement. The publicly funded college was facing an $11 million deficit as recently as last spring. Not only taxpayer money, but student tuition as well. Well, that sucks because we're like, I don't know, taking out loans to pay for it. <laughs> Not too happy about it, obviously, but what are you going to do? The board says it does reimburse a portion of the president's auto expenses. Regardless, the Taxpayers Federation wants the board to review all $78,000 worth. Dan Grummet, Global News. The province provides most of that school's funding. The advanced education minister, Aaron Selby, also was not available for an interview today. The ministry released a statement, though, saying it fully expects that any expenses deemed inappropriate will be reimbursed. Why do I support the Canadian Taxpayers Federation? Because families deserve a break. Because someone has to keep our politicians honest. Because honesty and hard work should be rewarded, not punished. Alone, my voice may not be heard. But together, our voices can't be ignored. 